What's up, everybody? This is Benny, a.k.a. One Lonely Cow, a.k.a. Your Mother's Favorite, and we're here back at Hearth for episode two. Now, before we begin, I want to let you guys know that we did do a little bit of filming for another video where Marshawn Lynch came into the store and did some awesome shopping, so we're going to roll that first before we get into the second vlog, but for right now, we're going to take you behind the scenes to the other store that's opening next week. Roll it. There you go. All right, now that we're in the store, we're gonna go check out the other location real quick, show you guys the behind the scenes, see how everything's going, and uh, we'll be back in here soon. As we talked about in the last video, this is gonna be the new spot for the Hearth store from January 2023 to May 2023. There's nothing in it right now, obviously, but uh, in a couple of days, we're gonna have some new stuff in there, so make sure to come check it out. We don't really have much, so we're just gonna shoot some B-roll and show you guys a little bit of what we got going on, and then we'll catch you guys in a few days for a store update, so roll it. <laughs> So we're gonna go back to the first store today and post the first vlog. Now, I know that you're watching the second vlog here, but this is gonna be an experience for everybody. So we're gonna go post the first vlog. And of course, if you haven't seen the first vlog, link down below, make sure to go watch it. It'll give you a little idea of what we're about here. So if you're watching this one, we're making the third or fourth vlog, just so you know. Let's go. So like a lot of fake Jordans coming through like StockX and Go and you know complex sneakers and because those those employees are trained you have 90 seconds to authenticate onto the next one. So a lot of fake slip through. Well, and you see also like if something comes through if you get a good deal on it in the size whatever and then they see that it goes up they just cancel your order and resell yep, it at the higher. Yep. Exactly. Price. Yeah. So they like oh, so they don't have good reputations. Exactly. Right. I'll say like, just like football, right? Like you can't just hop in and be like, okay, I'm gonna play now. Cause I got the money and the, and the coaches and shit, right? Like you just gotta know someone who, and I could help you, I'd be down to help you as well. Do something and really just build it. What do you feel like, do you wanna go to the back to your size? Yeah, this is it. <laughs> Can you bring those pairs too? Classics, right? What was your first pair of Jordans? My first pair? Yeah. Oh, shit, my first pair probably was uh, 13s. Jordan 13s? Mm -hmm. Damn, okay. We got these, your size. And these ones? Yeah. yeah. The, the shit flints. Out of my shit, Same. That's how I started selling stickers. Buy them on eBay for cheap, clean them up, sell them for a little like 20 bucks. You like that? Yeah, really right. how, how was the podcast? Oh, that shit was summit. Yeah? Or, so this is the backspace, like we kind of got organized by size. So I know you, you kind of like a lot of the Jordans, right? You tell me what you like, but you don't. You don't make everything you have in there. You got these? Uh, you know what threes I just got? Which one? The Korean threes. The Korean ones? Mm -hmm. Yeah, the Seoul Korea. Damn, where'd you get those? Korea. You were just in Korea? Were you really? That's dope. I'm like, uh, I got my stylist with me right like, now. She probably can make me and be like, yeah, yep. Oh, yeah? yeah. Okay. You want it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do that. Do you have the Amas? The, the fours? fours? Yep. No, wait, wait, wait. These just came out like last week. You you're into you said you're into dunks, Supreme, Dunk Low. I don't have those. I kinda hate. You, but hate you don't have them. Yeah, that's true, you don't. Kentuckys. You don't have those. Classic. Miami dunk the hurricanes. 
Yeah. Those I like. Are they out there? They are. Yeah. Thanks for coming by. <laughs> That's okay that they're broke. We got, we got you. We got it. We should have a 12. You don't have those. Those are the lotteries. Yeah. Oh, what about it's the hubs? 11. We do have hubs. But do we have a... Uh, well, we got 11 and a 13. These three? Oh, he said he only got 11 and hubs. We only got 11 and 13. Oh, yeah? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So I go from 11 to 12. Okay. But if I get the choice, you know, so so these are like the lottery. So if you scratch it off, it's like a lottery ticket. Yeah, I see it. Yeah. 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 This got to this got to come. Oh, that's the one you want. This got to come. No, that's the one you got. No, he wants. I think he wants them. Those also rub off. Yeah, but you don't rub it. Don't you gotta like cut well, it out or something? Yeah, I mean they're made to skate in, so the more times you more stop times you skate, them, yeah. It'll, it'll come like that, but, but he don't uh, skate, right? <laughs> we got those fours for you. The ones you said you got these ones. Oh, do we got you? Twelve and a half. Most expensive probably. Okay, okay. So this is your size here. This is that's twenty three. No, this oh, one. No, that's, come on. that's eight bands. Eight bands? <laughs> Bandos. Those are like there's maybe six yeah, or seven get that one. Okay. Yeah, Brittany, can you get the key for So get the other one. The band okay. But them other ones in three that I, I just showed you. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sydney, can you get a Lottery dunk, the gray and the green ones in a 12 or 11 and a half, and then the huff dunk in a 11. Sydney! No. Oh, you're good, you're good, don't worry about it. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I don't know what that shoe's doing, but it looks like it's doing If you press a button, it tightens the laces. Is that right? Yeah. Alex, you know how to do this, right? Oh, it's dead because we got to charge it. It comes oh, with a charger. Okay. I would have done it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No? <laughs> and these ones here, the expensive ones, 15 Which one? This one. You have 15? Yep. <laughs> this is eight. Oh, all right. No, that's nine. Oh, yeah, that's eight. Yeah, that's eight. What about, like, uh, clothes? Are you into, like, you know, the Chrome Hearts, gallery department? Yeah. yeah. What I like about this is Which one? Oh, the Deaf Hands. This is our good friend, has a company called Deaf Hands. And they got like, this one is Kobe. We got this one, Kobe. It's Mike. We got XL and everything. Yeah, let me get an XL and this one. And the Jordan one? Yeah, both of them. Both of them? Okay. Okay, just hold it aside here. Um, could you, could you, could you get the Kobe, the Jordan one, XL, Jordan XL? Who's your favorite basketball player? Probably Penn. Okay. What you know about me? No, I don't have the phone phone at Penny. Yes, I do. How old do you think I am? Okay, man, so you want to, we got the, sh the dunks you asked for. With these classic red ones, right? First Air Jordan ever made. What's all this shiny shit on? Because it's been five, six years since they released. So the leather went in the box. Mm -hmm. It kind of crystallizes with the glue. And then these, obviously, these are the 15,000 ones. This is, yeah. I think it was 08, 2008. Though, right? No, it's no, brand new. Stop. Brand new. Uh, and then uh, these are samples, so these never released. You said they never released? They never released, so we got them from a Nike employee who, Tell kind it. enough to, yeah, you know, I, I, yeah, I, I yeah, yeah. You, you know how it is, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so you want these, everything here, and then the rest here, right? That's right. Okay, come check this out, Alex. Yeah, yeah. So what, what, what are you gonna do with all these pairs, man? You gonna wear them all? You can put the pink pigs in a box. Yeah? yeah? Wear my shoes. That's awesome. I'll put them in like a display case. Nah, I wear my shit. <laughs> but now I'm looking at it. I'm looking at it. <laughs> Look at the total here. He's dropping 26,000 about. And that's light for Sean. No, nah, yeah. that ain't light. <laughs> cool, cool. Go ahead and insert it. My pleasure as always, my man. Let me shout out Wookie real quick. Check out Wookie Deft Hands with the hoodie, the, the, the Kobe and the Michael Jordan one. So, yeah. Benny, can you help take this for him? Yeah, I guess. Yeah? Safe travels, yeah. Good seeing you guys. Okay. Pleasure awesome. as always, man. Yeah. Appreciate awesome. you, yeah? Good, man. Appreciate, Appreciate it. you. Pleasure. Appreciate it. All right. Thank you. Thank you. All right, bro. Yeah, we're gonna do it. We'll make it happen. I know you. How are you? 
up, boy? Long time no see. How you doing? How you been? What's up, everybody? This is Benny, AKA One Lonely Cow. We're doing a new segment today on the YouTube channel. I know we just saw a bunch of footage from the Marshawn Lynch stuff, but I wanted to bring you guys a cool segment we like to call, What's in the Store? And essentially, we're gonna show you a couple of really special pairs that we have in the store right now, so you guys can see kind of the heat that comes through on a daily basis. So today we have something incredibly special. Not many people have ever seen these before in person unless you've come in and seen them in the case. I have never seen these before, but we're gonna show them to you. They are the Pink Pig Sand sample pair, never before seen. I don't even really know if I should be showing you guys this, but we're gonna do it anyway for the YouTube channel, so check them out. All right guys, check these out. All pink suede sample pink pigs. Now, as you guys know, the pink pig is a very famous Nike shoe, a Nike Dunk that came out a long time ago, very popular, very noticeable pink upper. But the most important thing about these that are different is these are all pink suede. The other ones I don't think were pink suede, or if they were, they were not this color, especially with the differences in the pink between the inlay, the inside, uh, and the outer. But the most important change on this one is all of the different words that it says across the shoe. Essentially, the shoe is cut up as a pig would be. If you've ever gone to a restaurant or anywhere where it shows a, a pig or a cow and it shows the different cuts of meat around the pig, it's the same thing with the shoe. You have quarter, swoosh, vamp. I didn't know this was called a vamp. I didn't know the front was called vamp. Then on the other side, quarter, I stay, tip. There's different pieces of the shoe with different names. And I think that's so cool. It's so important to have pieces like this in the collection. I mean, I've never seen these before, but these are one of the most beautiful dunks I've ever seen. These are going for 8K right now listed in our store if you want to come pick up, if you really want to spend some bands on something many people will probably never see in their entire lives, this is it. I'm really not even supposed to be touching these, but we're going to do it anyway. But I, I mean, I just, everything about this is so perfect. It's one of the most beautiful dunks I've ever seen. So uh, come check these out. But this is the first pair in our segment coming out with some bangers. There'll be another special one coming right after this. But uh, I wanted to show the YouTube channel. I wanted to show you guys these because they're just, it's something you don't see every day. And uh, it's pretty special that we have them here in the store. So Pink Pig samples I stay swooshes I call them the uh, I call them the, the the labeled the labeled pair this is the labeled pair so let's go to the next shoe after this yeah. All right, guys, for shoe number two, this is probably gonna be a grail for a lot of you guys, or at least some of you. Uh, I know for me, this was one of my holy grails back when I you know, saw sneakers as a kid in 2011, 2012. Release date, June 8th, 2012. None other than the Air Yeezy 2 in the Solar Red the Solar Edition. These are in a size seven. These are incredibly rare. You will not find a size seven dead stock almost anywhere. It's incredible that someone bought these and decided to keep them unworn for 10 years, at least 10 years. As you can see, so you got the eyelets, you got the classic eyelets, the snake, the faux snake skin across the top, classic solar colored insole. And then of course on the front, we have the little sun god. As a matter of fact, the logo on there, that falcon is the sun god raw from Egyptian mythology. It's supposed to be the uh, god, yeah, god of the sun. These are incredibly special to a lot of people. The bottom also glows in the dark if you're able to put it in enough sun and then put it in the dark. I have personally never seen a pair in person before this, so it's actually really cool for me to be able to have an opportunity to you know, interact with this pair. These are the second pair in the store. These are going for 15 racks. If you or someone in your family stumbled upon a lot of money or possibly won the lottery, these are the shoe for you. As you can tell by the box, yeah, it's got a little bit of wear and tear to it. It's been 10 years. I don't expect boxes to be pristine in this condition from this you know long of having them around um, also comes with well, at least this is the insole it also has the Sun God raw on the bottom which is crazy and then the last piece is the bag now for a lot of people the bag was one of the coolest parts again the Sun God on the front Nike sportswear on the other side this was one of the coolest parts up until this point not a lot of shoes 
had dust bags and Kanye kind of redid that whole thing and now a bunch of different shoes have dust bags or, or bags that it comes in like the Huff Dunks. Um, I'm pretty sure the, any of the Concept Lobster Dunks uh, have dust bags and a couple other really high quality shoes do. But there isn't a more iconic shoe silhouette than the Yeezy 2 in my opinion. It basically revolutionized sneakers and the culture in general. Still to this day remains one of the most holiest grails to almost any shoe collector. So this is the second pair. It's in store. It's a size 7. It's dead stock. 15 grand and it's yours. We could probably negotiate. But this is the second shoe that we wanted to give you guys for this segment. We're definitely going to do another segment of these in the next vlog. We'll get two more awesome pairs. But I wanted to give you guys some more cool content. Uh, be able to show off a shoe that not many people have ever seen either. Of course you can see it in the display case uh, if you come to the store. And if you want it, again 15 racks. So check it out. I'll shoot some B-roll and we'll throw it right after this. That wraps it up for episode two of the vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. As normal, make sure to like, subscribe, comment on everything that you see here. Let us know what kind of content you want us to uh, film and, and show about the store, because you know we're down for anything. So leave something in the comments. We're gonna wrap it up in the back.